some enjoyable sunshine, but still quite chilly on this Valentine's Day. Temperatures considerably below average. Our high only 21 this morning. We started off at 6 degrees above zero. No rain or snow to measure today, and we look to stay dry through tonight and tomorrow. By Wednesday night, that will likely change. Temperatures now across our local area, primarily in the lower 20s. We're 22 degrees in Delphus. It's 23 in Bluffton and 23 also as we look southward toward Wapakoneta. Some clouds have moved back in after we enjoyed several sunny hours, but these clouds aren't going to cause any trouble this evening and they should break up overnight. Our next weather maker arrives on Wednesday. Now ahead of the front, we're going to expect temperatures to climb quite a bit with a southerly breeze, but by Wednesday evening, this front drops in from the north and west. So rain is likely Wednesday night, and as a storm system moves along the boundary, that's going to increase precipitation into Thursday. Exactly how this low pressure center moves is going to determine how quickly we switch over to a wintry mix for Thursday evening and Thursday night. And with that, the chance for some slippery travel conditions after a weather warm up on Wednesday. By Thursday evening, it gets colder and that rain switches to a wintry mix before ending later Thursday night and Friday morning. So lots of quick changes over the next several days and still question marks with this storm system as it moves in. We're going to refine the forecast as we go forward in time. Our skycast close to home this evening, partly cloudy. Those clouds should begin to break up by later on. Late tonight, scattered cloud cover, but we stay precipitation free. Clouds and some peaks of sunshine tomorrow. As the wind turns around to the south, we are going to warm up. We really notice the weather warm up for Wednesday. Even with mostly cloudy skies, temperatures are going to spike into the 50s as the wind increases as well. Wednesday night, remember that cold front begins to approach. So some rain breaks out and rain looks likely for much of the day on Thursday before colder air returns Thursday evening. The pink on the map showing that wintry mix, a potential of snow, sleet and freezing rain. Likely the precipitation ends as a period of snow Thursday night before drier and colder conditions settle in for our Friday. Now, it's too early to talk snowfall accumulation, but plan on some slippery travel for Thursday evening or Thursday night. At least that possibility also with this system, quite a bit of precipitation, rain and melted snow and sleet upwards of an inch and a half. That could mean some minor flooding for Thursday. We're going to watch that possibility as well. Temperatures tonight falling back into the teens for lows. We've got temperatures above freezing tomorrow with clouds and peaks of sunshine, 35 degrees in the afternoon for Lima. And then Wednesday, warmer still, mostly cloudy. But look at these numbers back into the 50s, 52 in Lima, 55 in Wapakoneta by 4 p.m. Wednesday and then colder late Thursday. Partly cloudy, very cold tonight, 13 degrees by daybreak. Tomorrow, clouds and sunshine with a high in the upper 30s. Seven day forecast as we look ahead, mostly cloudy Wednesday, rain Wednesday night and Thursday. That ends as a wintry mix and snow Thursday evening and Thursday night. Cold on Friday, but we're mild again by early next week, 40s and 50s, Sunday and Monday. Katie.